Is there a time when you should not tell your story? Actually, there are two. Number one is if you don't have a clear message or point. You're just standing up there to tell us your narrative. Don't do that. As you've heard in other videos, have a specific reason to tell that story or audiences will check out on you. The more important second reason not to tell your story is when you are emotionally not able to deal with it. There's an old saying we use in the coaching world, do not use the stage for therapy. It is perfectly fine if in the middle of a story you get a, a little emotional, a little choked up, and have to pause for a few seconds. However, <laughs> if you're uncontrollably sobbing, don't do that to your audience, okay? I'm not a good sobber, by the way. Yeah, don't do that to your audience. You're not ready. You have not emotionally dealt with this problem, this story, this experience, and been able to craft it in a way where you can still feel the emotion, but not use that audience for your therapy couch. Those are the two reasons why or times when you should not tell your story. In the next tip, you're going to hear about a new revelation I've had about the number one reason you should be telling your story in business.